All right, you guys, I am currently in my RV on my bed. Today's video is a day bag video. This is the bag that I bring around with me everywhere. It's kind of like an adult diaper bag. That's kind of weird, but I guess that's the way you can look at it, minus the diapers. If you guys are new here, I do a lot of lifestyle mommy organization. I love doing what's inside my bag videos like this one here. I just did a what's in my purse video. So if you think I'm missing something, most likely it's in that bag. So you'll understand. I bring both of them with me um, when I'm going out or I'll stick things from my purse in this bag, which I didn't do today. I'm just showing you what I keep in here separately but like if I'm on a car drive I bring both bags I just like having my purse separate from everything that's inside of here if you're new here definitely consider subscribing hitting that little bell give your girl a thumbs up all that good stuff but today we're doing it like gorilla style we're gonna hop right into the video I have just moved back into my RV so things have been kind of wild so I am just trying to get this video out to you guys so you have something this week I post every Wednesday at 3 p.m. today's video was a little bit later but let's get to it so this is an authentic Gucci bag this bag was my husband's bag and then he just never used it and funny because I started using it he's like I want my bag back I'm like uh -huh, sorry sir we don't do that here um, anyways, I love it because it's so roomy and it can wipe down easy. It's like a canvasy material. I got this for my husband at an outlet years ago. So I'm trying to decide, should we go in the little pockets first or the big pocket? Let's go in the little pockets first. So in the top part here, this is all of like my medication type stuff. So I have this bag here and then right on the side here, I like knowing where people put their stuff is this little guy here. So for me, when I'm watching these organization videos, you gotta show me where you put it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I have this medicine bag and I've shown you guys this little wheel before in my what's in my purse video. I love this. I got this from the dollar store and I labeled everything. I put the amounts on the back. I'm gonna try to breeze through this video a little bit faster. Then I just have some Tums and then I have some, um, I have some electrolyte mix and also have some vitamin C packets but that is pretty much all in. Oh, and I have some Dayquil and NyQuil. So everything is in here ready to go and I just stick that in the top. And I, it's, it's repetitive, you guys. Like I have this here, I have it in my emergency kit, I have it in my 72 hour bug out bags, I have this in my purse. This is just everywhere. I like having, I have multiple ones of these. So I like having redundancy everywhere so I never forget or lose anything. Love doing that, highly suggest. Oh, and look at my nails, you guys. Finally got them done. All right, on the side there was this little container. I got this from Daiso. This is not an Amazon item, unfortunately. I have this little container that holds my pills. I have low thyroid and um, I take some hormone medication. So I keep those in there. So that's all that is in this top pocket here. Now in this bag here, I actually have a new day bag I'm ordering. I'm so excited, but um, I'll do a whole updated one when I show you guys. I'll do an entire updated video on my new day bag when I get it. And then I'll show you guys how to organize it when that comes in for you. So it's a little dirty, but I use this every single day. You flip it open. I just showed this in an Amazon favorites. This is awesome, you guys. So you turn this here and there's a sprayer and there's three different ones. So you can put three different things. So we have hairspray. I have to label them still, but we have hairspray. We have hand sanitizer. I haven't decided what I'm gonna put in the other one yet, but I love having this. It's a light pink color. Okay, so then in this one here, I do a lot of hiking. I'm actually getting ready to get a new hiking bag. And honestly, I've used this bag hiking. Ooh, I know. So I don't have anything besides this um, of what I put in my hiking bag. I also, I'm missing an umbrella. I'll put a picture here. I always have this on me. I don't know why it's not in my bag right now, but I don't just use it for the rain. We use it for the sun. I brought it with me hiking. It's so small and sleek. I love it. I've shown it to you guys before on an Amazon video, but anyways, I also have these binoculars. I keep these in here. I just, we do a lot of nature-y stuff and I like being able to have this so my kids can use them, but they're pink, gotta love it. And they're very, very good quality. Okay. So then on this side here, I got these little Ziploc bags from Daiso. Now you guys know I have floss everywhere. I always just keep it. And then I also have um, Q-tips. I just like having these, my family always needs them. So I just stuck these in the front here for now. You guys saw how I organized my purse with them. This is a little container that I got from the dollar store. 
and it has lip gloss on it in it but i scooped it all out and then i put my ring in here when i work out so i love having this but that is another dollar store find okay then in here it's my little mini tech you guys have seen this little charger a million times i just love it because it plugs into the wall i just bring it everywhere i put it in my purse it goes back into this bag goes back into the wall getting plugged in love this guy it charges very very fast i highly suggest this um also you guys have seen these in past videos um you didn't see it in my last what's in my purse video but i keep them in here now just because i don't have a lot of room because i have all my survival stuff in my purse so um this is a cute little bear charger this always comes in and out of stock sometimes it's not available and then i have this little light that goes on to the top of your phone but you can also use it to look inside your bag or um, you need a little bit of light doing anything it's great so next up we have i just pull the bag down this is the main compartment and I have a lot going on in here i'm going to pull everything out individually but let's just start off with my i my ipad my um laptop you guys this case is my favorite case i've had it for a couple of years now so i'm i think i got it right when i started youtube love this so much i don't know if it came with this little silicone thing um but i'm probably going to replace it because i it's my favorite and it's so sparkly but now it's starting to wear out because I've just, you know, beat it to death. But anyways, love this case. Always have my laptop on me. And speaking of my laptop, I wanted to show you guys this. Sorry, there's like dirt everywhere. Um, this is a Halo charger. And when I'm outside and I need to charge my iPad because I'm full-time RVing. If you guys don't know that, I'm full-time RVing with my family of six. I have four kids and a dog and um sometimes i work outside and edit so the kids can play which we're having so much fun we're getting ready to go on a huge long haul to florida we're so excited that's why my nails are disney because we're going to be going to disney world but i plug this in and you can plug in your computer this will even charge your car this is one of the best items i've ever bought you should totally get this and i love that it's pink of course okay so back into this guy so now you see on the left here i have this pouch i got this from the dollar store but i'm pretty sure i can find one on amazon that's similar i just have the cord that's literally all that's in here i just have the cord that goes to my computer and then next i have a little snack bag now i usually have other bars but these are all the ones that um, i could find at the store that were near um, but i just have a couple kind bars and then the kids have nutri green bars and i always have lollipops that's kind of one of my things if there's like a meltdown or you need your kids to be quiet, always you just give them a lollipop and literally they're quiet for at least 10 minutes. <laughs> so next up, as you can see, this stuff is all on top of here. I just have this container, which I'm gonna get into last. And then I have this, okay? This is my family sunglass container. Everyone's outside right now using them, but there is little slots here. You just put the sunglasses in and there's I put the babies in one, I put the big kids in one, and Nick and I have our own because, you know, their sunglasses are so small. But I just love that they're all in one container. I love that I figured this out. And it's funny because a few of you have just been mentioning, I love that you repurpose everything. This is actually for jewelry, but what a great idea. And then too, if you really want to protect them to not get scratched, you just put one of those microfiber glass things and you can just stick it right in there if you're really concerned about them getting scratched. But I've never really had an issue. So love having that in there okay then i have my planner i just this is one that i use for work um i stuck this louis vuitton sticker on here it's starting to come up right here i'm so sad um but yeah i just have two planners and then i have this one here also if you guys didn't know this i have a etsy store that has all of my planner printables here let me see well for example i have um different menu ones and they have the pink or you can do the ones that are blank like that and then i write down all of my menu so i can see it here so i don't have to like really think about what i know how to make or what our favorites are and then i just start making out uh my menu here and then i also have and then you have your grocery list here so anyways i have a bunch of different ones i, I also have a bunch of like car printables so you can have them inside of your glove box for emergencies and all that good stuff but i have daily calendars weekly calendars all that good stuff so love having my planner on me i literally couldn't live without it 
And then last but not least, we have this container here. I love this, you guys. I've used this in my, I have a cruise video and I put a bunch of stuff for a cruise. Actually, it was medicine for the cruise. I bought like giant bottles because everybody always says like that's one thing that's scarce and I always wanted to bring extra just in case anyone else needed it that was around me. But you pop it open here and what's really cool is it folds open like this. Isn't that nice? So. I like to be prepared for every situation and scenario. If you can relate, that's most likely why you're here. Um, <laughs> I like having all kinds of stuff on me. Like I said in my what's in my purse video, I have all of this. I have all kinds of stuff for survival and everything like that. So most of the things that I carry on me are in that bag because that one's always on me. Now this bag is usually with me um, when I'm doing like day trips and I do a lot of day trips. so. Let's get into these. I'm gonna go into this bottom pouch here first. So I have some antibacterial wet wipes. These come in a pack of two from the dollar store. These are so great to have on you. I also stuck in a little nail glue. You can use this as super glue for whatever you need to, but I just love having nail glue on me just in case. Then I have this, which I'm sure this is, I've shown this like years ago and now everybody's using it in their videos, but this is a lint roller. It's called Flint. You can buy the refills on Amazon. Love having this. Always have an extra tied stick. You cannot have enough of these. These are miracle workers. And then this, I have to have this on me. I can't tell you how many times my family has used this. This is definitely one of the things I like to have on me. I have two of these. All right, so let's get into the top section. These are just products that I like to have on me. All right, so the first thing is I like to have dry shampoo on me. I have hairspray in that other one um, of the three one that I showed you guys. This is DEET bug spray. Because we're always hiking, DEET is really important because of ticks. Um, this is a Chanel Chance perfume. Love this stuff, it smells so good. My husband got this for me for Christmas last year. I just got this from a hotel. It's bath gel, but I'm gonna use it for hand soap if there's soap, if there's no soap in the bathroom. Then I have spray deodorant. I feel like my little deodorants always melt, so I wanted to get the spray for on the go. Then I have some cocoa butter formula, which heals and softens. Love this stuff, smells so good. And then I have some SPF 30. Also another thing you guys that I keep in my bag is a rain jacket and an extra outfit. I usually bring those in an extra pair of to wear in like a clear bag. And um, I like having those on me as well. I don't have it right now because I'm putting those into my hiking bag, which I will show you guys in the future. But that is pretty much it you guys. All right, you guys, I hope you enjoyed this short video of all of the things that I like to pack with me in my day bag. I had so much fun doing this video for you guys, and I'm sorry it's a little unorthodox in the style this time around, but I just wanted to get something out for you guys, and hopefully next week we'll be back to regular scheduled programming. Hope you guys are doing well. If you haven't already done so, subscribe and hit that little bell. Everything will always be linked for you down below, and I just announced the winner to my last week's video, so definitely check that out as well. Take care, you guys. Bye. Bye. Doors that open